Hello and welcome to my channel. It's the writing out the whole Bible project. Yes, I, I know I'm a bit slow with this, but I'm getting there. I mean, it's not a marathon, or it is a marathon, it's not a sprint. So I'm doing it in my own time and I'm engaging with it, and I hope you are too. Where do we get to? Well, we've got our green book which has got my notes in it and it's got my progress reports in it and I write on there how many pages I've done and what date that I've done them on and as you will see I have actually started Mark just yesterday and today I've been doing a bit of Mark but that's that one what I do want to bring to your attention in the um, at the end of when I'm writing them, I'll usually put in some facts and figures about how many chapters, how many verses, blah, blah, blah. I came a bit unstuck with Matthew because the usual pages I use, the information wasn't right. Um, it, it's one of those things I'd printed it out, I stuck it in, and I thought, it doesn't look quite right. So I found another website, and this one gives me see that that one gives me the chapters and verses in it doesn't give me the words but uh, you can find them on other ones now this website is that www.neverthirsty.org org yeah that's got a lot of help on there so i just want you to know that the the bible chance that I was promoting go get go a bit careful always double check what they're doing so this is our bible that we're going through what I liked about this let's just open it up because when I actually came to the end of Matthew there was a picture of dad and Jean and I thought very fitting. It's like Dad and Jean have said, yes, you've got to the end of this chapter. Well done. <laughs> so that was good. I'm still in the yellow book. What I'm doing, I know it's got Matthew on the end, but it will have Matthew and Mark in it. Now, what do we do for Matthew? In case you haven't seen it, I'll go through it a bit. That was my insights. Yeah. Bears again, as it would be. Then we turned over, we had another bear, and we got going. And if you haven't seen any of my writings out, I always put a little bit of black pattern work in the pages just to brighten them up. What I also do is every time ooh, let's have a look, we get to a new chapter. I change the colour of my pen. It's just to so that it's not there we go, changes, brown green, brown. Just so it takes a bit of the monotony off of it. So that was how um Matthew was going. And it went right through and there's still the little bits of pattern and still a lot of writing, changing of colours. You see? Quite a big one. It's just <laughs> pages and pages. Sometimes there's more pattern than others. But I wanted to let you know that actually, look a little, <laughs> oh my, my own handwriting. It's funny how it sort of, sometimes it's neater than others. I think it depends on your mood a bit. So this was my facts page and as I said you may just see the tip x because I had to go over it and put the right figures in I got there in the end and that was the first chart that I was telling you about can you see this sorry there we go so it was biblecharts.org but as I say do double check go and look at a couple of sites 
And this was the ones that they gave you these, the interesting facts. But as you can see, I've had to cross it because all three of them were out. Do you make sure you've got the right information? For Mark, I've gone with floral gardening. I like that. And away we go, Mark. It's off. <laughs> yeah, Mark is on his way. I've also done some, like the, ooh, let's have a look, some of the little pattern squigglies in the future pages so that they're ready for me and done. Why did I think that I could get two in here? Well, my logic is I took the measurement of what Matthew was in the Bible and the measurement of what Mark is in the Bible. And because Matthew only just went over the middle, Mark is, is smaller. So I figured I'll get it on the end of the book, which gives me two in one. That's the plan. I could come completely wrong here and have to start another book. I don't know. But uh, at the moment, Matthew is done. Why am I doing this? Uh, because I like it. Because I like engaging. Because I like writing. Um, because I'd seen it done and I thought, oh, that's a good idea. Lots of reasons. You do it for your own reasons. However you want to do it. Only a tiny video this time, but I'd wanted to update you on where I was with my writing project. So I shall say, do give me a thumbs up, do subscribe, you stay safe, take care, and I shall say, bye-bye for now.